I literally take a day off and everything is changed in state of survival. Ah shit, here we go again. In today's video, I want to go over the most important changes when it comes to heroes. Today's video is sponsored by Paxify. Paxify offers you 10 to 25% discount on bundles to instantly boost your account. I have been using Paxify for a year now and I have saved up enough money to go on a holiday. A huge amount of players are already using Paxify. Check out the testimonials of these top players. Are you worried about your account safety? Keep 100% control over your state of survival account by binding it to FunPlus. It's 100% safe and there's absolutely zero risk. Make sure to check out the link below and you will be able to join the Paxify's Discord server where you can meet other top players and share in-game knowledge. And while you're joining Discord servers, you might as well join the Jumping Gorilla Discord server without sugarcoating it. They absolutely murdered Nicola. Without making it too complicated, the values of the first and the third skill were basically cut in half. Now that's a substantial downgrade. His first skill made your infantry troops deal 60% additional damage every two rounds to all enemy troops. That has been reduced to 30%. His third skill did 15% additional damage to the target by the riders every round. Now that has been reduced to 10%, which means that Nicola is no longer the best garrisoning infantry hero. Now you're probably wondering, what should I use then? And I have two options for you today. If you are in a young state, and with young I mean every state that is on Gen 1 to Gen 7, I feel like Ray is your best option. He remained untouched in the skill downgrade and when we were testing him last time around we got pretty good results with him. I tried him myself on my state vs state this weekend and I have to admit that he did pretty well. Now if you are in an older state and with older state I mean everything on gen 8 and upwards it is the return of our king. No not Aragorn but Hank. We've always known that Hank is one of the best options around and he didn't get touched by the new skill update, at least until they decide to nerf him as well. So it's back to Hank for Gen 8 Plus. In the Rider department, we have a big issue. Unjo was a very good option for pay to play, for free to play, basically for everyone. Just like Nicola, she got a substantial downgrade. I've made a dedicated video on Unjo only recently. Her first skill is now only doing 25% damage and her third skill only 5%. Now that's what I call literally cut in half, which makes Unjo way worse and probably not the best option anymore. And unfortunately for free to play, there isn't really a free option as best garrisoning hero for riders. If you have a joker level 4, he will outperform every single rider hero in garrison, which is a shame in my opinion. The uprise of Nicola and Unjo gave free to play players a very important role in garrisoning. Unfortunately, with this skill update, we are going back to pay to play as garrison leaders. Anyways, in the coming weeks, myself and Kratos team will do testing to find the best formations again, the best combinations again. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you never miss that upload. In the hunter department, they made some changes as well, but they are not near as substantial as the rider and infantry heroes. Sorry for example got a downgrade and Travis became even worse than he was. Anyways that will be it for today I hope you enjoyed the video if you did I would like to see you back in the next one. Bye!